you know, I've had some exceptional cups of coffee. Great cups of coffee. Bad cups of coffee. Terrible cups of coffee. I've had coffee from all over the world. I've had coffee local. I've never had a coffee. So that's me if I had a death wish. Now, I went through their website trying to find a little bit of history about the Death Wish Coffee Company. I didn't find a whole lot. So today's video is basically going to be about the review of the coffee. Now, I will say I did open the box, but I haven't opened the coffee yet. Their marketing is exceptional. I really like the box that come in. Um, I also get a sticker. This coffee here is already ground. It is uh, Death Wish Coffee Company, the world's strongest coffee dark roast ground. We're going to give this a shot. And just like every other coffee review we've done, we're going to try it black and then we're going to try it with milk. I'm really digging the box. Just saying. So let me get this here open. Sure if that's how you're supposed to do it or not, but that's kind of how we're doing it. Well, I can smell that. Oh my. What do we got here? Oh my god. I have never smelled the coffee that strong. Alright, we are going to make it in our Keurig like we usually do. And get some without spilling it. I, li I drink dark roast all the time. I drink espresso like it's, you know, just regular coffee. But I will drink a lot of it. So this being dark and smelling as dark as it is, is right up my alley. Let's just see what, oh, I spilled it. This looks like dropping gold if you ask me. All right. I'm gonna get this in the Keurig. All right, while that's brewing, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the coffee. It says, dark roast, bold flavor, reliable, doesn't ask questions. All right, I wouldn't expect my coffee to ask me a question, but let's keep going. Our OG bag of beans may be the only morning friend you'll ever need. If you're lucky, each cup of Death Wish coffee brews smooth with more caffeine to fuel your busiest days. We recommend at least one cup first thing in the morning. Now again on the website I didn't find a whole lot of uh, information about the company. I did look around but not thoroughly. So I, what I would like to mention is that it is a fair trade coffee. Just powerful, real coffee, no BS. Death Wish Coffee sources only high quality, fair trade, certified and organic coffee beans. When you buy fair trade you're supporting the the livelihood of the actual farmers, which I've mentioned on numerous reviews in the past. Well, like I said, I've tried all kinds of coffees all over the world. Never had one that was uh, possibly threatened to kill me. It's done. Let's give it a shot. Oh my God, is that black and strong. Wish me luck. Hey, uh, if, if something happens, somebody call 911. Oh my god. Let me put it to you this way strong is an understatement. If you have an automatic brewing coffee maker, so you rise and shine in the early morning at say 6 a.m. You set that coffee maker at 545 so that your coffee is ready when you stroll yourself out of bed. You don't need an alarm clock. I can tell you that right now. Uh, when this is brewed at 545, it will make its way upstairs to your bedroom, slap you in the face and drag you back down the stairs. I have never had a coffee that strong. You go back through my videos, you can see that I've reviewed 
tons of different coffees. I have never had a coffee that strong. But it's good. I mean, I wouldn't drink that before I went to bed, but to get your day going? So as with every other review we've done, this is black. I don't know that I can drink it black. I can probably fight through it, but I don't know that I can drink it black. We're going to add a splash of milk. Give that a little mix. See if maybe it'll uh, just throw me around a little as opposed to slap me in the face. Whew. Death Wish Coffee Company. I'm almost at a loss here. It's just kind of odd for me. I can drink it with the milk. It's good with the milk. It's good black. Don't get me wrong. It's good black. But I couldn't drink it all day. I will drink multiple cups of coffee in a day. And I, by multiple, I mean multiple multiples. I could not drink this in multiples throughout a day. Early mornings, absolutely. I mean, this coffee will start your car for you. Before I go to bed, you might as well not even pull the covers up because you are not sleeping if you drink this before you go to bed. With milk, I could probably have a few of these in a day with milk. Yeah, I like it. So Death Wish Coffee Company, this is a excellent coffee. Dark roast, already ground, I didn't have to grind it up. Normally I like to grind my beans, but this was already ground, saved me the step. I would definitely recommend this Death Wish. Death Wish? Death Wish? Death? Find your words. I got it in my pocket here. Death Wish Coffee Company. This Death Wish Coffee, I would definitely recommend it. And no, this is not a paid endorsement. I did not buy this bag. My brother-in-law, Scott, gave me this bag. Uh, he happens to live across the river over in Michigan. A couple weeks ago when he came over here, he brought me a bag. He says, I got something for you to try. Scott, that was an awesome bag of coffee. Uh, I imagine it's going to last a lot longer than some of the other coffees because I cannot drink as much. I probably could. Then you would be calling 911. It's been a while since I reviewed coffee, and as you see, my coffee bar's got a little bit of whiskey bar. I wonder if we need to make a change. What do you all think? I think we need to make a change to the coffee bar? Maybe update things a little bit, change things a little bit? Don't tell Jen. Anyway, that's it. That's all I got for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed that. If you already done so, folks, hit that subscribe button down below. We'd love to have you along. Ring the bell. Share the video. All the stuff that goes along with that. I'm not sure what I'm doing with my hands. <sighs> Thanks for watching. Later. Oh, hey, I almost forgot. The best way to drink coffee is the way you like to drink it. Later.